So, both are that to form the continuous tube-like structures, where the two cylindric, uh, where the two xylem vessels are connected, at their common walls, the showing of that uh, pits. are porous okay then this conduction of water and minerals from one xylem vessel to the another xylem vessel by the pores okay they are known as that pit fields after that <coughs> xylem fibers Xylem fibers are elongated, elongated xylem xylem fibers are. elongated structures xylem fibers are elongated structures with sharp ends okay silval is made up of lignin Silval is uh, made up of lignin. After that, it provides mechanical strength to the plant. provide mechanical strength to the plant it loss protoplasm okay so they are known as that uh, xylem fibers <coughs> this xylem fibers diagram Salem fiber, narrow lumen. After that, Xylem parenchyma. Only it is living in Xylem. Only it is living in Xylem. Okay? The cells are, the cells are spherical these cells are spherical or oval ok cell wall is made up of cellulose a 
it contain a perfect nucleus it contain more amount of protoplasm it contain more amount of protoplasm it involve storage of food material in the form of in the form of starch in the it is stored <coughs> it is stored food material it involve storage of food material in the form of starch and fat okay only it is living in xylem the cells are spherical or oval cell wall is made up of cellulose it contain a perfect nucleus it contain more amount of protoplasm it involves storage of food material in the form of starch and fat rape in this rape parenchyma cells in this rape parenchyma cells involve radial con conduction of water minerals radial conduction of water and minerals water and minerals rare parenchyma rare parenchyma cells involve radial conduction of water and minerals